Hello friends, welcome back. Today we will see Boolean logical operators. So they are logical and logical or logical XOR which is exclusive or short circuit or short circuit and logical binary not and assignment or assignment or assignment XOR assignment equal to not equal to ternary if then else. Okay, so these Boolean logical operators will be applied only on Boolean. So please take care that we will be applying this Boolean logical operators on Boolean operands. So what it does it mean is we will be taking two Boolean operands. Okay, we will be taking two Boolean operands. This is Boolean operand 1 and I will be applying some AND operation or whatever on this. Okay, so this side also I will be having another Boolean operand and the outcome of this will be again Boolean value. Reason why we said Boolean logical operators and herein I am also covering, I will be covering short circuit operators which are logical OR and logical AND and also I will be covering ternary operator which is question mark colon okay so ternary so we'll be seeing all these three kinds of operators with example now okay so before seeing an example let us see this table this table shows us the effect of each and every logical operation performed uh, between the operands and this works uh, similar to your bit logic uh, example that we have seen in bitwise operators so let us see this table once. Okay, so these are the two operands like if it is false and false, if we are trying to apply or between them, it will be false. False and true will be true. True, false will be true. True and true will be true. And for and, if you try to perform and operation, so if both are false, false, any one of them is false, then it will be false. If both are true, then only it will be true. Okay, for exclusive or, so it will be if both are for, both are false and both are true, then it will be false. Other than that, it will be true. Then for not, uh, it will be inverse of this. Okay, so if it is false, it, if I say not A, then it will be true. Because it is false, it is true. Then it is true because I inverted it, so it becomes uh, false. True and not A will be false. So just keep this in mind so that we can uh, work out in the example. Okay, so just uh, take a look at this particular program. So I have declared two variables, okay, of boolean type. A is holding true and B is holding false. And then we performed all these operations on this particular boolean operands. Okay, we'll see the output of each and every operation now. Now, we'll try to take a guess of what will be the output of uh, C. If I try to print a C, uh, C what will be the value? Okay, so this is how the operation takes place. I said A or B. The value of A is true and value of B is false. So true or false will written in a true. So C's value will be true. And then coming to D's value, it is A and B. A's value is true and B's value is false. So true and false, please check the truth table that I have given now. Uh, uh, in the previous uh, slide okay so then it is false then true and exclusive or false which will be true so the value of c will be true d will be false and e will be true okay so here so i'm trying to print the values of uh, a here so the answer will be true a's value is true b's value is false and then a or b is what true and A and B is what? False. A exclusive or is what? True. Okay. So now we will calculate the value of F here. Okay. So F is this. Okay. So we will try to evaluate this expression. Not A and B. Okay. So not A will result in false. Okay. And B is false. False is false. Okay. So false and false will be false. And uh, then there is an then there is an or here and then a and not b okay so or has come here and then 
a a is true so true is here and b not b is there okay so not false not false is meaning that it is true so true and true will result in true now these two um, values will be evaluated so false or true okay which is true so the value of f will be true so the value of f will be true okay so next is g's value g's value is not a a is true so not a means that it is false so g's value will be false this is a very simple program which will explain all these operations okay so we'll uh, take a look at this particular uh, bits as well okay so i'm saying uh, boolean a is equal to true and x is equal to false x is true okay a is equal to true and x is true and we are saying uh, we are applying this compound assignment on this okay so i am saying x and is equal to a it means that the operation will be performed on x and a and the result of this will be again stored in x okay so what is x and a x value is true and a's value is true so true and true will be true so x will be holding true okay so in case for example if a is false okay so in case if a is false then true and false will return in false so x value will change x value now will now become false so hope you understood that and you can also perform or compound assignment or and compound assignment exclusive or you can also use this uh, equality between the booleans in if statements while statements and all that okay so this is regarding boolean logical operator